What is good friends, we are back and I'm nervous and I'm tired but I just got a game to prevent decay and I won that game so I'm number 38 on ladder right now. So we're using Eclipse Sand, which is pretty cool. Um, so I scarred this guy's replay and I've seen um, Skartana is probably Scar from the moveset. It's Mega Lari, um, I guess it's a death trend because it's your Lava Plume. Landris is most likely defensive, AV Bulu and yeah. Did I forget him on? Yeah, not sure if this up was a static or pressure. But I think knockoff is like a good play. Like I risk getting pearled by Zapdos, but other than that, it's a good play. But he's pressure. Okay, so we get information, he's pressure, we get rid of his leftovers. Um I probably have to win like two or three games and then maybe three or four games to get top ten. Um but yeah, Zapdos is a bit annoying. We're gonna go uh Fable here. He obviously discharges trying to uh, power the T Tar. Now, go get my rocks up, but I do risk getting paralyzed. Um, which is okay, I think I have to risk it, kind of. So, every softball here, he might show defog. No, he just wants to para and he gets it. Okay, no full para, thankfully. Now, um, could um, start call mining up to force him um, out. And if I don't get parry, I keep rocks up. Keep rocks on the field, which is important. So um, I think Silla is always my play here. He could double, but uh, with rocks up, it's not a big deal. And yeah, that's fine. I go Tita here, and I can click uh, Stone Edge as long as I hit. It's perfectly fine. I kind of want to roost. Uh, off quick breaking the roost, but Edge is just my play overall. Should have quaked, I guess. Maybe miss. Okay, that sucks. Um, that would have done a lot, that edge, but yeah, as long as we hit on the Kartana, that's cool, and we get a crit. So, I guess crit is cool after missing, but still kind of sucks as he does in the trend. Now, um, he's Lava Plume, which means he doesn't have Magma Storm, which means Pex is my play. Uh, I threw a power on Scissor to low Heatran, but I still didn't want to risk that. I knew he would probably go for rocks. But it just wasn't worth it. Now I could go for Toxic here, breaking the the Ladi switch or the yeah yeah I'm, okay he taunts me. I didn't think he would make that play. It's okay, it's okay. Like I'm not the as Taunt was like a risk free and good play by him, but I still I predicted his Ladi, which is why I made my play. We get a burn there, nice and lucky. Does this Ladi have HP fire? Like I'm gonna go full try hard mode, right? Some people don't have replays because they hide their rooms, but if I find a replay, I'm gonna take advantage of that because I'm really gonna try to peek now and I'm tired as fuck. So it's cool if I can. Um okay, he goes to that. Now um, we can super power here, it hits the Heatran and it hits the Kartana. And we hit the Heatran on the switch. Oof! Right, this team is so fire and it's meant to lose Heatran. We got a crit, that's unfortunate, that probably mattered. That only does around 65, 70 without a crit, but we are adamant, we are adamant scissor, but that still matters. Um, but yeah, this team has been working the best for me, I've tested it on multiple accounts. It's pretty fire, um... Anyway, so, um, I, if I go clef, I still risk getting, um... I still risk getting parahex to death, which sucks. Uh, I guess I'll just go Tita here, he goes Kartana, makes a good double there. Um, I think my play here is probably Tornadus because it kind of covers him doubling. He stayed into what knockoff? Sacred Sword, okay, breaking my scissor. So this gives me a free U turn um, on most likely the Zapdos, right? And this gives me a rapid spin with my Excadrill because this rocker is dead. And yeah, I know I'm most likely gonna have to take a Heat Wave, but this is completely worth it. Um, hopefully, no burn. Okay, no burn, nice. Uh, well, now um, I can go to my Tita here. As he parrots me. Um, that's unfortunate, but we're gonna attempt to hit an edge. Uh, obviously, kinda hard to hit an edge through para, but we shall see if it can happen. Amazing. Okay, so Landris takes 58. I'm gonna calc that damage real uh, quick. Damn, like I'm so nervous because if I win this, um, that brings me to like 1950, which is like the highest I've ever been on ladder. But like I said in the earlier video, I haven't like ever really ladder try hard that much. So I just want to finish this road to top 10 because I cannot like. Okay, so he's defensive lando for sure. 
Uh, no, no, he's scarfed bulky, I think. Bulky scarf, can that be? Let's say choice scarf, but... Let's say max HP choice scarf, maybe. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Somewhat bulky scarf. Um, so rocks are off, so tornadoes is my play. U-turns out. Yeah, I don't think I can lose this game. So Zapdos gives me a U-turn. Well, Tita being low is a bit dangerous, because Tita and Driller both are kind of low. Um, Driller Clef. I could also Toxic this with my Spidef packs, but I don't want to risk that. Mm, I have to be- no, I don't lose to Bulu ever, because I have Scissor plus Torn. Lari gets walled by Scissor. Yeah, I don't think I can lose this game. I did lock him a bit, yes, but I don't think it was game-changing, like I still had a shot. But I can also not think that clear at the moment because I'm tight as fuck. So yeah, I'm just gonna play safe, tr get punished there, um... Okay. I'm gonna have to, um, fuck. Try to get a command up, but... If my clef gets hexed down, it obviously sucks, but yeah, this is fine. I can just go scissor here. And yeah, I don't think I can lose the game. Like obviously Zapdos can parahex half my team, but it's not gonna matter too much. So I think we just roost, keep this healthy. Oh. Kinda wanna double to pack Seaprick in the Zapdos and fire off a Toxic. Because I think he's forced to go in the Zapdos here. So yeah, I can go to this and Toxic. Uh, as long as he doesn't powerful para me here, I'm good. So he makes a good play there going Lottie. Reads me well. Um does he have Drago? Yeah, he has Drago. I mean, Tornaze is kind of free. Tornaze is free because it covers him doubling. Like, I could go Scissor as well, but Tornaze kind of covers, like, it. Actually, it doesn't matter, yeah. He does just Psychic. This gives me a U turn, and we can see AV Torn eats that up. So we go Scissor here. Um, he Dracos. Does a million, uh, but he shouldn't be able to kill me with anything if you change it to HP. Oh wait, that kills, right. Wait, um, yeah, I miscalled there, so I sank myself for no reason. Yeah, see, I'm messing up now. <laughs> but this lets me, um... Fuck, I messed up there. Okay, let me not choke this away, fuck. This lets me get my rocks back. I sank my scissor for no reason and scissor won the game. And in my head I already had um, like scissor in the thumbnail when I was trying to recover this team. So I really gotta calm down now. I know I misplayed there. I'm super tired. I'm like I was up all night, it's like morning now. Um, throwing scissor out the window kinda opens up the bulu, which is scary. Um huh. Let's go Tita here to get grassy terrain and you can just crunch here. Because I know um, hitting edge through para is not that easy. So, and I already hit one through para. So I'm gonna crunch. Yeah. I had no reason to throw my scissor out, but like I said. Like I'm just kind of nervous and it's. What's it called? I'm not. I can't really deal with and handle this at the moment. So that para is a bit annoying. Not the biggest deal though. Um, makes a good double there. We're just gonna try to do, um, see if this heat wolf kills. As it does, amazing. So I think we have this now, because um, Tornado should just solo his team. Did his Lando? Yeah, his Lando is Scarf. So we always go Clef here. You know, don't risk a Stone Age crit. U turns good play. Doubt it matters though, because this always gives me Torn. And if he knocks off, good play, but it doesn't matter. Um, yeah, so I did misplay a bit, I did get lucky a bit, but it doesn't matter. Okay, that does a lot, that does a lot. So yeah, we go Pex here, he can double, doesn't matter too much. Should go Lottie here, um, I really want to double the Torn. But if he predicts my double into Torn, I'm kind of screwed. Um, I thought he would do it, but he didn't, well. So this is have Edge, oh god. What's his Z-move user though? Cartana was scarfed. This could be Z move. Oh fuck. I might have misplayed this as I eat that. Okay. Um, I think I have to set my driller. Maybe I should have. I should have done that last turn. Uh, risking Pex dying was not the play at all. 
But yeah, now um, we can go for Hurricane and then trust my Tornadoes. Is this a well trained tornado? No. Oh, God. Okay, so U turn here. Uh, we go into T Tar and we just click Crunch as long as we don't. Uh, Pursuit is probably the better play, but yes, we don't. As long as we don't get paralyzed here. I was gonna say we kill the Tita, but we do get paralyzed. That is quite unfortunate. Um, I don't think it's game deciding, but yeah. I mean, I also hexed him a bit, so. And then I gave him an opening by sacking myself for no reason. <clears throat> so let's see if we can hit this hurricane. Skip turn, because I'm gonna get a heart attack otherwise. Because if I lose a game, I'm gonna lose so many points, and I just wanna win, because if I keep winning. On business. Um, this is really scary because he can leaf blade here. He might just be able to clean me up with leaf blade. Um, Cartana, oh, your choice, God. I'm pretty sure this. Hmm. Tornadoes. Uh, this is max HP tornadoes. Leaf bed in grassy terrain is a uh, doesn't kill me, so I just have to hit the heat wave. Wait, he's not scarf. Or did I knock him off? I thought all the time he was scarf and he was probably banded. He was probably banded, right? <laughs> I didn't even call the damage. I should have called the damage. Good Lord Almighty, but yeah, I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, he fought is amazing. So we are now 1953, which uh, puts us pretty high on the ladder and. Whew, where is it? Where is it? We just have to win a few more. Um, this puts us as number um, 26 on the ladder. Just a second ago, you guys could see hyped Dockeridge almost top 10. Now you guys can see Mad Dockeridge. Um, I have some of the hacks that happened to me on the screen. Also, you could tell from the video, the game that I played, I didn't play optimally because I just wanted to rush it to get top 10. And I should have just gone gone to sleep and played when I could focus. So I got hard matchups, uh, not playing optimally because yeah, tired, can't focus. Uh, plus hex, which means I dropped to like 1800s. But yeah, don't you guys worry. I will. I, I recorded all this like a few weeks ago. This part that you guys just saw. I already made a new account and laddered up a new account. And the final part will go up probably tomorrow or in a few hours after this. So yeah, stay tuned for that. And thank you for watching. I was planning to put sad music over this, um, but since uh, I don't know, since I'm not sad anymore, because I recorded that a few weeks ago, I don't know what music I'm gonna put. But yeah, stay tuned for the actual finale. And smash that like button if you enjoyed.